Hello. Hello. We are Russian scientists. I am Victoria Popova, Doctor of Science and PhD professor, author of over 100 scientific publications and 14 patents. And I am Lydia Andrianova, PhD, author of over 50 scientific publications and 4 patents. We have written 15 books, two of them in co-authorship with Marina Popovich, world-known legendary military test pilot with 101 world records. Extraterrestrial civilizations long ago on Earth. Over millennia, they have built many thousands of complexes and formed the system of information transmission, which covers the whole world. All extraterrestrial civilization complexes are pictograms with common symbolics. Extraterrestrial civilizations complexes are created by information technology inaccessible for humanity. We discovered two keys, analog and digital, for decoding the messages of extraterrestrial civilizations. On the base of these keys, we read many hundreds of pictograms of extraterrestrial civilizations around the world. Among them, Stonehenge, the wonder of the world Machu Picchu, the Pyramids of Giza and the Sphinx, Moai of Easter Ireland, Mexican Complex of the Moon and the Sun Pyramids, Chavin de Huantar, Chan Chan, and many others. As a result of decoded complexes pictograms, we composed the Dictionary of Extraterrestrial Symbols of Consciousness for over 300 symbols. Now everyone can read and understand messages from extraterrestrial civilizations. Extraterrestrials have now begun to transfer emergency information. It is the latest instructions which extraterrestrials transmit to humanity for the transition before the global cataclysms beginning December 21, 2012. Starting today, we will report them regularly on our YouTube channel Our Transition 49 until September 22, 2012, the date of the beginning of the second pre-cataclysm. According to this scenario of global cataclysms beginning, the third and strongest pre-cataclysm will happen after the second pre-cataclysm. This scenario will be finished on December 21st, 2012, when global cataclysms all over the planet will start up. Their enormous power will be incompatible with organic life forms in humanity, so human life on our planet will be impossible. Extraterrestrials have warned that it will be impossible to hide anywhere on the planet in order to wait until the cataclysms end. Global cataclysms will never stop but will become even stronger because their purpose is the complete destruction of our planet. First of all, the surface of the planet has to be leveled and mountains turned into piles of sand. Humanity has never faced the fury of global nature, disasters of such power. Extraterrestrial civilizations show mankind the only way for salvation. All people of Earth, independent of their religion, nationality, race, sex, and age, must simultaneously unite consciousness with a common goal, to cause a laser beam that destroys our bodies at the level of global cataclysms. At the same time, humanity will reappear at the highest level of the material world. This way, the universal resurrection of all mankind will happen, as described in the holy scriptures of many religions. Thus, humanity will make the transition to the highest level of the material world, into the new cycle of life, the cycle of correction. In this cycle will be only two divisions, hell and paradise, and everyone will be responsible for their actions each day. So, do good today. The transition can be made only by the whole civilization simultaneously. It is impossible to be saved one by one. The unification of civilization consciousness for the transition into the next cycle of life will not affect anyone's private property. The transition is not new. Extraterrestrial civilizations constantly make similar transitions through the parallel worlds of the material world for intergalactic flights in the universe in hundreds of millions of light years. The second pre-cataclysm on September 22, 2012 will begin suddenly for humanity. It will be a natural phenomenon of incredible strength. Its epicenter will occur in the ocean near the coast of Peru, 
in the area of the Brazilian magnetic anomaly where the magnetic field on Earth is the weakest. The main blow will be directed to the east coast of North America. The famous American prophet Edgar Cayce predicted that as a result of natural catastrophe, within a few minutes the waters of the Gulf of Mexico will join with the Great Lakes. Detailed information about this event is presented on our site www.ourtransition.info As a result of this unprecedented cataclysm, numerous nuclear power plants which are located in the way of the natural disaster will be destroyed. This means that heavy radioactive contamination of the environment around the world will happen. This will bring incredibly harsh conditions to life on our planet. In addition, international communications will be interrupted. This will make the synchronized unification of our civilization's consciousness for the transition extremely difficult. This means that after the second pre-cataclysm on September 22, 2012, only a very short time and incredibly difficult conditions will be left for the transition. That is why extraterrestrials urge humanity to make the transition before the second pre-cataclysm until September 22, 2012. The laser beam necessary for our body's destruction can be caused by the action of the united consciousness of all civilization. Our consciousness is too weak and cannot cause a strong action. Only the united consciousness of a huge number of people, the entire civilization, can cause the required action in the form of a laser beam. If the second pre-cataclysm happens with its full force, a lot of people will be destroyed. The remaining population of the planet will then be insufficient to create the laser beam and to start up the mechanism of the transition. In this case, our civilization will have no chance of prolonging its life and will be destroyed by global cataclysms. So in order to keep this from happening, the extraterrestrial civilizations will significantly weaken the power of this natural disaster. Humanity does not have to worry about the overturn of our planet's poles. It will not happen before the transition due to the extraterrestrial civilization's efforts. Overturn of planetary poles is caused by the magnetic field of a planet weakening through zero. In this case, all organic life on Earth, including mankind, would be destroyed within a fraction of a second. So, humanity has to make this transition to the next cycle of life before September 18, 2012, in order to avoid the different circumstances which will arrive due to the beginning of the second pre-cataclysm. We have to form groups for the training of consciousness, unification, for the transition around the world. Please inform us about these groups by email. Alidia8 at yahoo.com or vpopova at gmail.com Today the most important is action. Listen to the next message with em extraterrestrial civilizations emergency information on our YouTube channel, Our Transition 49. Our website is www.ourtransition.info.